Fox's MasterChef Junior is the cooking show for young aspiring chefs. And last season, a girl from Milton won the top prize. This is the biggest moment in my entire life. They're calling you an inspirational <laughs> female role model. That's amazing. You know, I've gotten to travel to different places, be featured in magazines. But one of my favorite things that I've been able to do is actually go into public speaking. I think that Jasmine has really just begun to make her mark on this world. My name is Jasmine Stewart, I'm a chef, and this is my hustle. I started getting into cooking when I was around the age of three. I started through my parents. My dad's from Jamaica and my mom's from Virginia, so they would both come home and make these pretty amazing dishes and I would be like, this tastes amazing and I need to figure out how to make it. I think when I realized I um, had a talent for it and a passion for it was when I started creating my own recipes. At a certain point, I honestly just took it into my own hands and started creating different recipes and trying different flavor combinations. And so I started making steak and salads and using different utensils and using different methods and that's kind of how I got better from there and just continuing to practice. Wow. You've just raised the bar. Being on MasterChef Junior was like nothing I saw in my future. Being on TV, let alone winning it, is just crazy. I got to work with Gordon Ramsay and Christina Tozzi, giving me such awesome advice. And I really just got to practice my craft and showcase it on a different level. And it was phenomenal. And I wouldn't change it for the world. Yes, it was great that she won the show. Um, but I think watching her battle her, her way back after being eliminated, um, and hearing them call her name and give her back an apron was pretty cool for me. I'm a force to be reckoned with, and I'm definitely channeling my Jamaican roots to win that trophy. This has a very unique <laughs> aroma. A lot of opportunities have come since winning MasterChef Junior. I've gotten the opportunity to have my recipes featured in magazines. This is actually the MasterChef Junior cookbook, which is pretty awesome. This is actually my appetizer in the finale of MasterChef Junior. I did scallop and smoked trout fritters, which was really awesome, and I did it with like, green papaya, salad, um, and this red pepper peanut sauce. I got to work with Great Wolf Lodge to create a whole new kids menu and revamp it to create really upscale items for kids. One really awesome thing that happened to me in my lifetime was that I got this proclamation where I got a day named after me. Um, the day is June 21st of 2017 and it's called Jasmine Stewart Day, which is pretty awesome. Lemon time. Mm -hmm. Got a lot? Yes, yes. Uh, this should uh, make for a nice salmon dish. All right guys, welcome to my kitchen. So today we are going to be making my Caribbean spice salmon with a spice blend inspired by my dad and his side of the family. I like to start off with some red pepper flakes. This just adds a little bit of kick. And you know, since we're going with that whole Caribbean flair, we need tons of spice. Here I have my chili powder. This is also gonna add a nice kick. And what I love about chili powder is almost kind of like the depth that it gives you. It gives you a little bit of a smokiness um, to our spice blend. Pretty good amount of cinnamon because um, we do want that like balance of heat and sweet. I'm gonna start off with adding olive oil to our fish because it will allow everything else to stick to it. She can you know, take what I cook every day and I think it tastes okay and then she will make the exact same thing and I'm like, oh my God, it's delicious. And something that I'm super proud of is that I also got to start my own company called Just Jazz LLC where I'm inspiring girls to let their inner girl slay. <laughs> I know that me as a teen and some of my other friends around me, a big issue that we battle through is just self-esteem. And I wanted to create a way to empower girls and to let them know that who they truly are, let that out. And I honestly believe that you should wear what you feel and express yourself through your clothes because if you are what you say you are on the outside, you'll be the same thing on the inside. 
some people would say that I'm pretty successful, but I still have a long way to go and a lot of things that I want to accomplish. And so I continue to follow my hustle and continue working hard and hopefully one day I will get to my goals. So that's what my hustle means to me. Hi guys, thank you so much for watching my video. Make sure that y'all subscribe to The Whistle and follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter at Just Chef Jasmine. That was my hustle.